Hey guys, welcome back. Jonathan Majors and Megan Good have a big announcement. They are getting married. The two actors, yeah, actors, Megan Good and Jonathan Majors announced their engagement at Ebony Magazine's Power 100 Gala on Sunday. Megan and Jonathan's surprise engagement comes a week after word spread online that they were done, 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 done. According to a popular blogger, Megan and Jonathan went their separate ways, presumably after their contract had expired. You know, there had been rumors that Megan and Jonathan's relationship was manufactured by Marvel Studios to repair his public image among black women. His career was nuked after he beat his ex-girlfriend Grace Jabari senseless in New York in 2023, March 2023. Supposedly, the fight started in a right chair after Grace caught Jonathan texting Megan. A jury convicted him of assault and harassment. He was sentenced to a 52-week mandatory in-person domestic violence prevention program. So just a few days ago, a rep for Megan denied rumors that she split from Jonathan after dating a little over a year. They are not broken up. In fact, they will be attending the Ebony 100 Gala together, the rep told TMZ. At the gala, a reporter asked how they were doing, and Megan bluntly said, in love. And then confirmed that Jonathan is the one. Oh my goodness. I can't with these two actors. What a coincidence that they announced their engagement at the very same Ebony Gala. Okay, check out the clip, you guys. That was some terrible acting. Look at this. This is the action of someone that's looking for attention, trying to put on a show. She's like, look, 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 look. And he did this goofy look. He did this goofy thing with his face. And she's like <laughs> laughing so hard. And the thing is, he didn't even say anything. And she's like toppling over with laughter. Like, oh my gosh, he's so funny. And he didn't even say anything. What the hell was that? This is bad acting. I know a lot of people are saying these two are putting on a good act. No, no, no. This, there's nothing good about the, this act. It's so bad. It's like, what? It's bad. And it seemed forced. It seemed like they are forcing themselves to, you know, it's, it, oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. And, you know, Jonathan has a violent history with women that dates back to his college days. He's been abusive since his college days, okay? Once an abuser, always an abuser. They are like leopards. They don't change their spots. Abusers use violence to control women. And then this lady right here want to pretend to be in a fake relationship with this abuser. Now she's going as far as being so-called engaged. Freaking a fake engagement. A fake engagement. It's like, is she that hard up for publicity? I understand she's never had this much attention before. But you doing all this because of what attention? This is crazy to me. This is crazy to me. You cannot convince me that these two are not just, they are just friends. They are just friends and she reached out to him to help him out or he reached out to her to help him out through his, you know, abuse uh, situation. 
trial and everything. So now they they don't think that these people are not would not do things like this. A lot of these celebrities, they they get involved in fake relationships. They even go as far as bringing babies, bringing kids into the fake mess. Okay, so don't think like okay because they engage it must be real. No no no, they go as far as bringing kids into their whole fake mess. You know they have contracts. You know that will be like okay, you're gonna be with this person for six years. They want kids. You're gonna provide kids if you can. It's mind blowing how far they would go with their fake relationship, fake marriages. Seriously, it's a real thing in Hollywood. It's a real thing. They will go as far. There's nothing that they wouldn't do to keep this fake mess going. Okay, they'll even bring, as I said, they'll bring kids in it. They'll have kids with each other, knowing damn well they don't even like each other, knowing damn well that it's fake. He could be gay, and they or she could be gay, or they're both gay, and they're just using each other as beards. It's wild. It is wild the things that these people are willing to do to keep this fake illusion. Yeah. So don't think because now they are so called engaged. Oh, it must be real. Oh, no, no, it doesn't mean anything. These people will go far just to keep. This mess going just so they could be in the public eye. They could still get attention, and it's it's a mess, okay. And you know what's crazy? Black people, black women are still skeptical of Megan and Jonathan as a couple. So they're doing all of this, and people are still not buying it. Let me read some of these comments. Cleared up the breakup rumors quick up. So you paying his bills, huh? Yeah, that's another thing. There,、uh, there were reports that came out that she's the one who's um paying his bills, you know, because he have not worked in years, so she's paying all the bills. So you know what? So that means she probably purchased this fake engagement ring. Yeah, it makes sense. She paid for the fake engagement ring because look, she even paid his child support. Reports came out saying she was paying his child support. So someone was paying someone's child support. You don't think they would buy their own engagement ring? Come on now, come on now. Okay, this one comment. They said, "I don't know. I see two actors being good actors. No, you mean bad actors. I see two actors being bad actors because." None of that is good acting. This one says, "I'm still not convinced. This is I'm still not convinced. This is a real relationship. See, they're not even convinced." This one says, "I'm just trying to understand how he got the money for the ring. He ain't worked in over two to three years." <laughs> my gut. This one says, "My gut feeling is never calm when it comes to him. Hopefully, I'm wrong." Yeah, so a lot of comments were just like, you know, people not believing their fake BS. Um, so yeah, so it's it's crazy. It's crazy the things that Megan is willing to do, is willing to do, to keep this fake illusion going, just so she could get. She's obsessed with publicity now that she she got it by dealing with him. She got it, so now she's obsessed because they were just done. Reports came out they were done. Okay, and someone went on the Ricky Smiley show saying they know for a fact these two are done. And then the rep came out quickly and said, "Oh no, they will attend." The the gala the gala on Sunday, <laughs> and look, and then look, they already planned this fake stuff, right? So they probably got a ring right away, because it's like they were just they were just done. The rep quickly came out and said, "Oh no, they will be at the gala." Like that was a weird answer, right? 
And then, sure enough, at the gala, she came with a ring on, like, <laughs> look, look, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that's fake. That is so fake. And normally, when these celebrities get engaged, you know, they, they like to be so-called private, right? When they get engaged, they don't announce it. You know, they'll wait till you notice it when they're out and about. Or, you know, or they are questioned or they'll have an article written about it. The fact that she went on the red carpet and then she's the one that put it out there. She didn't even wait for anyone to notice it, the ring on her finger or anything. She just like, look, look, look at me, look at me, look at my hand, look. So that was very, very, very telling. You know, how do we, your, your rep is saying, no, they didn't break up. And then boom, two days later, a whole day later, you on the red carpet and you're the one that's putting it out there. What happened to privacy, you know? You don't want that want people to notice it. You don't want that's like, look at my hand. You put up your hand in the air, like, look, look, look at me, you know? So that's that just screams fake. That's fake. Celebrities don't normally do that, you know, because they know these, pa these paparazzi notice everything or they know that, you know, these bloggers notice everything. So they'll just wait for someone to write about it, to ask them about it, things like that. But they don't just, like, voluntarily just, like, look, 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 I'm on the red carpet, look at my hand, look at my hand. And then she said it, she said, look. So, yeah, that just screams, I'm putting on a show, I need this attention, let's go with this fake publicity, let's try to break the internet, and we know that's not going to happen with them. So it's giving fake, it's giving try hard, it's giving, you know what, let's just do this, you know, let's do this, let's, you know, let's break the internet tomorrow, you know, and they tried, and it's like, but they didn't act it over, because that acting was bad, it was bad, she should have waited till someone notice it or have someone ask her about it you know quietly and then on camera then like oh, <laughs> oh but no she the one that you know and then you see like it just fakes if you watch the video just watch you be like what if that doesn't scream fake to you the second that you watch that video then you need more discernment okay <laughs> seriously because no that was they, they failed at that that was a hard fail that was a hard fail. They felt really bad on that red carpet with this engagement announcement. It was bad. They could have done better. They could have done better, but since they want to deceive people and she wants to help this abuser by pretending to be in a fake relationship, now a fake engagement, then it's like, no, you have to call out the BS you know, these people are frauds, okay? So, you guys, what are your thoughts? Do you believe this engagement or do you think that they are going to ride this fake engagement until they can't anymore? Leave it in the comments. Let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and thank you for the support. I will see you on the next one. Peace.